Hi everyone, and this is the Legendary Arm back again with more. This time I'm going to be doing another video. And this one is going to basically be an update video and to say happy anniversary for this channel. Yeah, it's kind of a weird thing to, to have like a video for, like for me at least, because I didn't really do many anniversary kind of videos. I basically did like specials and things like that for reach a certain milestones, but I wanted to say thank you for all of your support for the past 10 years. I know it seems like a long time for any YouTube channel to kind of exist or to do anything for, but it's been a whole 10 years. Basically, you watch me grow up. <laughs> like, you basically watch me go from, go from basically just a little kid that was inspired by a bunch of Beyblade YouTubers to actually helping me become a Beyblade YouTuber myself. And on top of that, I was able to also express my love for Bakugan, as um, shown here. <laughs> and then I was also express, I was also able to express my love for Biamon and Lego over time. And I know that I haven't really done like Lego stuff in forever, but those moments still mean a lot to me. And I do have like Bomberman stuff I may never review because it's so old. But yeah, if you if you want me to review these, I can. I can. And then for like um Bakugan stuff, I know I'll do more of that. But yeah, just overall thank you for just supporting me and being here for me throughout all these years. I know that it's basically been like a big um <laughs> it's basically been like a long time. It's been just a whole long time in general for um for me reaching this far because I remember in the beginning I just had like someone hold the camera for me, hold the phone. Because that's what I used to record videos, but yeah, it, it used to, it's like back then I used to have like some recorded videos with a phone. Yeah, I still use a phone now, but it like I used to have someone kind of hold the camera for me, like to hold the phone for me so they could actually just, um, so they can actually just help me record a video for YouTube or even just upload one. And now I'm basically doing everything myself with like a tripod and I got to learn like editing. Like, I've learned editing through YouTube, so every single time you just see me use a different font or a different effect or something like that, then that's just me experimenting. And I'm trying to just find whatever works for me. And yeah, I still haven't really found what works for me yet, and I've used PowerDirector for about a few years now. I don't know how long, but um, yeah, just thank you for being here. Thank you for growing up with me. Thank you for watching me grow up or whatever, like, wherever you've wherever you come from, wherever kind of life you're living or anything like that, just thank you for sticking with me and thank you for all the new people that have come around too because I know that I haven't really been like the most active in the Bailey community just like on YouTube in general, but I came back strong this year. I really did. Um, things might slow down. I'll say this. Things may eventually slow down as, um, as time goes on because of responsibilities and things like that with my life outside of YouTube but I'll still do my best to do as many videos as possible and still just show my love for like the things that I like which is basically a lot of stuff from Japan I'm not sure if you noticed that but it's like I've gone from just basically like a whole bunch of stuff from Japan even in my like um Secrets of the Legendary Dragon I kind of use like some Japanese for it is it's basically just me using Google Translate, but yeah. Um, in terms of like an update for what I'll do next, I can't really do. I'm not sure if I'll do a live stream or not because my actual anniversary, which is probably when like around the time this video is uploaded, is actually on like around the 321 go shoot day, and I don't want to. I know that I might have less viewers because of that, so I don't know when. When should I do like a live stream or something like that to celebrate? Just. Let me know in the comments and I'll try. Um, in terms of other news, like a little update. I have some Bakugan stuff I'll still be unboxing. I have some diamonds to now unbox. Um, I guess I could do like a what's wrong with Bakugan video, like the main flaw of it. So yeah, I might do that. I know I'll do like a collection video for Bakugan eventually then. For Beyblade, I'll try to do like a collection video. Maybe not stay in collection video, but like a collection video for the Beyblades themselves. Um, 
I know I have a whole bunch of things like planned for now on. Like um like I'm going to actually try to finish my Die My Battle slash Burst Ultimate kind of um collection and then whatever comes next for Beyblade, I feel like I'll um I might take a back seat. <laughs> I think I might take a break, take a back seat, just kind of relax, you know, <laughs> enjoy what's in front of me instead of um rushing to the next thing immediately. So that might affect the views, it might not. Um, either way, I'm just really happy for all of you that have been supporting me, have been here for me throughout all of this. So, thank you for your patience. Thank you for being here by my side and sticking with me throughout all of this. Um, I know that me growing up was something. Um, yeah, like, even now I'm just doing like TLR classic videos, trying to upload like the older stuff. So, it's like, um, you might see Turbo Beyblades, you might see Evolution stuff. I still have like one box from Evolution that I haven't opened. But yeah, just um... Yeah, I kind of don't know what the future holds, but... In terms of me, I'm going to get the... going to get like the Bakugan from the rest of um... I'm going to get the Bakugan, like the rest of the Bakugan from, from Legends. And then after that happens, I'll stop with Bakugan. And then for Beyblade stuff, I'll just continue on with like Takara Tomi primarily until we um until we figure out what's going on with Hasbro because Hasbro is I don't know what they're doing. I think um there's one thing I wanted to mention is that the Pandoras, the, the three the four Pandora Beyblades, I'll try to get those like in that I think there might be like a four pack that might come out, I think. Yeah, I'll try to get it like that way and then I'll have like Pandora versus all of Dynamite Battle and First Ultimate or something like that, but yeah, other than that, um, I'm pretty much done. Like, I have almost everything for first that I've been wanting, and then I know I'm still kind of filling in like the gaps a little bit, but I have almost everything. And then for, um, whatchamacallit, and then for Metal Fight, I'll go back and do more Metal Fight stuff. There's, there's only a little bit more of Metal Fight I need to, so. Yeah, I'll get that over time. But overall, I pretty much have... I'm in a good spot right now for, like, Beyblade stuff. Um, in terms of, like, the future of the channel, like, I've kind of already told you what you can expect, but... I guess another thing that I wanted to say is that since I'm basically doing all stuff from Japan, like... Japan-based, um, like, Japanese toy-based, or something that's from Japan... So, I'll just be doing more Japanese toys in general. So that doesn't mean it that doesn't mean I'll always do just Beyblade stuff or just Bakugan stuff or things like that. So you might see a little bit more variety in the future. Just gonna let you know that. So I might do some Bomberman stuff, then if anything else that comes out from Japan now, like I might actually do that on this channel. So for so for like my second channel, I basically wanna do like more anime and game related stuff. So I'll be doing like gacha games which are like anime mobile games and then I want to do stuff like um I'm not sure what else but I know that I want to just basically have like this channel for like Japanese toys and then my second channel be for like anime and like um like any other like anime anime games or like whatever kind of games I like so yeah that's basically what the channels will be going forward I'm not sure what else will come out or what else I'll be doing because for me, I'm basically just kind of, I'm taking my time with everything. I'm kind of just going at my own pace and whatever I like is when I upload pretty much. So there might be a, a few, um, so there might be a few kind of, kind of deviations from what you're used to with the Beyblade stuff, but even with those deviations, I still want to let you know that even though Beyblade is my priority, I'm still trying to kind of just, um, kind of just show like this channel is a way for me to express my enjoyment for whatever it is that I like and that's mainly just stuff from Japan <laughs> but yeah that's about it so like if you want share if you want and subscribe to become a legend in the making see you next time bye and we are proven to be legendary stay legendary by the way um thank you for 10 years of just everything thank you for 10 years of this channel I appreciate it very, very, very much, and, um, bye. Oh, one more thing I want to say is that, um, 
is that I'm not sure if this video is uploaded yet, but for all the people that are wondering like where does the mon the monetization money go, it actually goes towards more Beyblade stuff or more stuff for the channel. So yeah, I'm not sure why I got the first time, but I I know that more recently I got like the stadium set. Like the stadium set with um Bahama and Yeah, Belial. So that's kind of yeah, that's basically what I got. But yeah, that's about it. Um, bye. Okay, so there's actually one more thing I wanted to mention, and I didn't get a chance to put this in the video. I'm not sure how I'll kind of show it, but there's actually a, um, I'm not sure how I'll show it, but basically I changed my channel logo and channel banner to kind of celebrate the anniversary and to also kind of kind of give like a new restart to my um to basically my whole the whole look of my channel it's basically just like it's like my whole kind of style has evolved and i really just wanted to kind of show it through like um like showing pictures of Iga. so i have pictures of Iga on the um on the channel banner now and it's all red and then i have the legendary r since 2013 because 2013, even though my channel started in like, um, 2012, well, it was created in 2012, I actually started making videos in 2013, with that very first video. Um, and then for the, this is proven to be legendary on it, because that's now my kind of, that's now my kind of catchphrase. And then for, um, and then that's about it. And then for my new logo, it's actually just, uh, um, it's like a color switch, like a color inversion in some way. So instead of having a blue background with with a red R, there's now a red background with a blue R. So yeah, that's, that's what I'm doing now. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to go over that. I'm not sure where I'll put this in the video or if it'll be in the video at all, but either way, that's about it. Happy anniversary.